Right, look at this, look at this. <gasps> look, look what the <laughs> look what the wind's done. Oh my goodness. Hello, welcome back to the Dad Delivers vlog. I've got a bit of an emergency on. I'm gonna take you, I'm gonna take you with. It's really stormy today. We've had winds of up to 50 miles an hour in the night, and I've got a situation in the garden that's been going on for a long time. Uh, but it's getting worse <laughs> by the day. Oh my goodness. And it's this. It is, uh, right, so this is a eucalyptus tree that I bought for my unstoppable wife. And I only got it a few years ago. It was not that old. And um, it's grown really well. But the, it's, I, I planted it like way over here but it was obviously far too close to the fence, which I didn't realize. And now look at it, it's just destroying not only this fence, but it could bring the whole lot down. And I don't know, I don't know what to do with this. So I've got an idea. Oh my goodness, look at it. <gasps> look, there's just like sawdust there. All right, so my idea is this. I'm gonna try and put up some kind of bar so that the bar takes the weight instead of the flimsy fence. But I'm not sure, I mean, it might be too late. Anyway, let's get, uh, I don't know what to do. Let's get a piece of wood first. So into the, the garage of dreams. Oh, hi Casper, you okay? Yeah, Casper's checking up on me. I've got some really nice wood, but I was gonna use this to fix a hole in the happy hut, which is gonna be another video. I don't know if this is going to work. This might be a complete waste of time. But the idea is, if I somehow attach this in front of the fence, it could take the brunt of the, of the weight of the tree and maybe even spread the load. So it's going to work like this. A bit of wood goes behind the tree. Oh, it's so heavy. I can see already this isn't going to work. Ah, damn. Ah. I can see already this isn't going to work because oh, the wood's too short. I've got to get another plank. Okay, I've got this piece of wood uh, from my bench. I don't know if, you, if you've seen my bench video. I built an L-shaped bench in the kitchen. And bizarrely, it's almost exactly the right width. I'm being lazy, I should cut it. Oh no, it's exact, it's exact. Oh, that's a sign. It's a sign from the universe. I've manifested a solution or something that will give me some hope. Uh, let's just test it. Oh, it smells really nice, this tree. I need to, I need to get my drill. I should probably have done this months before now. Not probably, I should have done this months before now. By the, by the way, this is a Dad Delivers vlog where I try new things to make your family happy. And the new thing I'm trying today is to save our fence from being bulldozed by a eucalyptus tree. Oh no, I'm trodden in. Oh, Casper. Oh no, no, oh, I've done two of them. Oh. Right, so this is the patch where Casper lets out when we don't let him out. Oh man. Dude. Okay, so I'm gonna clamp this. I've got a couple of clamps. Oh, by the way, our neighbours are really understanding. So I wanna get I want this to make this work for them as much as us. All right, so if I, it's a big tree. Probably do, should have two people to help me do this. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do this. I think I'm gonna need my unstoppable wife's help with her unruly tree. It's never easy, is it? I, N, E. Maybe that, that could be the temporary fix for today, so that the weight is taken on the post, and not the fence. I don't want to lift it up because it's just going to fall down again. Oh man, these winds are biblical. Okay, 
That's how I want the brace to be. Don't fall down. I want it to be up there. I want it to be at the top. And I think it's just gonna fall down. So I've temporarily, I'm out of breath. <laughs> so I've, oh, I've just stood in another one. This is gonna be my temporary solution for now so that this wooden brace takes the weight of the tree for now across the posts. I prefer it a bit higher just to stop that branch hitting and grinding against the, the fence there. What, what would you do in this situation? Please leave a comment below. I'd love to know what, what you would do other than go back in time and plant the tree in the right place. I think my biggest fear right now is that although it's keeping the tree up, what it could do is put the whole weight of the tree across all of these fence posts that aren't really built to take that kind of weight and push. So all of the posts are gonna bend in the wind. Oh, what am I gonna do? What am I going to do? Oh, look at this, look at this. <gasps> look, look what, the <laughs> look what the wind's done. Oh my goodness. It's okay, Casper. Okay. No, don't bend. Don't bend. Whoa. Oh, I can't get it up. <laughs> I can't get it back up. fence was last of my worries. Oh man, doesn't seem to be damaged too much. I mean last time, funnily enough, last time <laughs> the trampoline did this and ended up <laughs> right in the fence. <laughs> we couldn't get it out. It was completely jammed into the fence. But I've managed to avoid that. So if I put the camera here, you can watch me put it back into position. I think it was here. Okay, let's put some stones on it. What can I do? What can I do? Might actually get to start some work now. <laughs> okay, it's the next day, the trampoline's back. That situation's sorted. Casper's uh, playing football over there. So this is roughly in place. We're just gonna screw it in now. I've got some help from my wonderful son. Uh, do you wanna do this? Oh, I can't believe I have to do this again, mate. Yeah. Professional. Fantastic. Oh, look at that. Hey, nice one. High five. Whoa. So it's not entirely ideal, but we've got the tree away from the fence. Uh, it's still encroaching, but at least it's taking the weight there. Obviously, I'm worried that that is now going to bring down the whole lot. That would be so uh, funny. It would, wouldn't it? But, um, New dad delivers how to fix entire fence. But I'm calling this a dad delivers success. It's slightly unfortunate that we've got footprints on the, on the nice wood. You're going to fix the fence? Yeah, that's, yeah. I don't know how. So obviously it's not ideal, but um, it's going to hold <laughs> for the wind for today. Um, and obviously I need to sort the tree out and fix the fence somehow, but hopefully this is just gonna just keep it upright just a day or two longer. Thank you for being awesome and hitting the thumbs up or the subscribe button. It really helps us keep this thing going. And right here is what YouTube knows that you're gonna love watching next. Can you please help my daddy get 10,000 subscribers? Just click on his face. Thanks, bye. All right, this is gonna be the proper one, mate.